Hey, my brilliant, powerful Virgos. Welcome to Swift Intuitions. This is for my Virgo sun, moon, and rising. If this is your first time on my channel, go ahead, like, and subscribe. Hit that notification button if anything resonates. Even if it don't resonate, go ahead and like this channel, okay? All right, Virgos. <coughs> Let's see what Spirit has for you. Messages of clarity and truth. Messages of clarity and truth. Okay, Virgos, the first thing I do see is addiction. So right now, I see codependence, obsession, possession, control. Spirit says that this is your energy family. It's it's a um, it's a good time right now for you to release control. It's a time for you kind of like to pull back from that very thing that you are wanting and, 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 and start realizing that you don't need it. And if you start feeling these obsessive type of energies, especially towards a situation or a person going your way, Spirit says it's very important for you to do the hands-off approach, meaning if, if it's something that's meant for you, uh, put your keep your hands off of it and allow it to come to you. Because, or or if this is not your energy, Virgo, I feel like there's somebody in your past that is codependent on on the love that you once gave them, and I feel like it's no more. And right now, this person has a lot of blocks and control issues that they're dealing they're dealing with with the, with you, your separation. I feel like right now they're coming in. They want to talk to you. It's an energy of someone really wanting to reach out, but not knowing how to reach out from the past. It could have been because of some of the things that have taken place in in you guys past that they feel uneasy or they feel like rejection will come. I also see the sword of truth, um, the sword of rose, which is clarity, truth, revelation. Somebody is understanding the truth about a situation that is between you and them. I feel like if this was somebody that always played the blame game and never really took responsibilities in the things that they did, now this person's really realizing their faults, their flaws. And I feel like this is playing with their mindset because it's the energy of someone feeling like they are missing out on you and your time, your energy, your attention. We have the boat. This person is, is having a hard time uh, closing out a cycle with you. So even if you haven't heard from this person, it's like you could probably have dreams about this person or something about them always pops up in your mind, like maybe at the most craziest moments. And that is because this person is is really um, thinking about you very hard. They're, they're, in, they're going through a mental battle on how to contact you, if to contact you, when, when it's gonna be the best time for you to actually uh, receive them when they do call. So right now, this person is having problems moving on from you and I feel like you've already given them that energy. This person wants to come in and talk to you. They wanna see if you wanna date them. They wanna see, they wanna hook up, they wanna go out. This person wants to make plans. It's like hoping that you will give them just one more opportunity and trying to make the situation between you and them better. But I don't feel like this person feels like that's gonna happen. Uh, I see this ascending. So this is the energy of once this person hopes that once they tell you how they feel or the truth about a past situation, that that this obstacle will be something that will bring you, you guys back together. But I see right now you're expanding, um, Virgos. I see right now you're in a new phase in your life where you're really just on an up and up, not really wanting things from the past to come in and distract you or to derail you. So it's like um, not really sure on if you should take a risk on something from the past. And that's your energy now. And I feel like the person that's coming and they self-sabotage the, the the past relationship and right now you're just like we're, we're good where we're at you know nice to the clarity what's coming from my virgos yeah this person didn't make healthy choices when it came to their love i feel like this person uh <clears throat> this person uh uh needs to execute self-love oneness with oneself so when this person does come back, they have not healed. So you have the choice to accept the type of, to accept this energy that still remains as it did before you guys separated, or you could move on from this. But this is what's coming your way. All right, Virgos, I love you. Love yourself. Understand we are the gods, and there's nothing they could do about it. Bye, family.